Hey, how are you, little lemon drops? Little guided soul. This is gonna be your love reading. The cards are mixed, but I'm still mixing them, so they're ready to show what energy is swirling around you. If you're looking for a confirmation, then take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Trust that the universe has a way of speaking directly to you. So, first I'm going to get some information about what's going on and then we'll get into some questions. The Empress, the Justice, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Six of Wands. I feel like there's something um, that's been going on in your life that that you don't see how much progress you've made, but really it has been happening just behind the scenes. And it's really come to a stable point where it feels like it's feeling like you could celebrate if you could only see what this was behind the scenes. Upright, we have the Justice and the Empress. I think you, either this situation has to do with the way that you're being perceived or the way that you, you feel. Either way, it's brought you to a head where you feel, where you are understanding your own value and and the person that you can be um, as a love reading this would talk about the lover that you are and even though it could have been tough not seeing how far you've actually gotten with this person it's really made you into an excellent human being who's more primed for this love than you realize. All right, love. Let's ask a couple questions now. I'm gonna save the best for last. I wanna know what this person could potentially your person could potentially be going through right now and what they're thinking of when it comes to you. The tower card and the nine of pentacles with the queen of pentacles. They see you as very abundant and patient. I think you've adapted really well to this situation, whatever it is. And this person could be coming through a difficult energy in their astral where they're... It could be anything in their life, but the way that this relates to you is how it's brought them to a place where they can see you as a stable person, as the empress that you have become, whether you're male or female. The Empress card is part of our of every one of our journeys. As you can see, it's the third major arcana card. It's part of understanding our own divinity and our own um, potential to grow something in this world. And they're seeing you as very, perhaps financially or abundant in general and grounded and patient. I want to know what's going to happen between you two. What is going to happen between you two? Temperance, the Emperor in Rivers, the Four of Swords, and the Judgment on the bottom of the deck. This person thinks that they have made an incorrect choice when it's come to you and perhaps you could have a discussion about this. This discussion could creep on you slowly but this person they're confused as to when the right time to do this is 
and how they're gonna go about this and feel like like you can see them in a good way as well it's difficult for them to know how to approach the situation perhaps they could be embarrassed perhaps they wouldn't know what to say because of things that went down between you two I'm not sure the world card this person sees you in a really high light I think that you inspire them to see life as bigger than they dreamed about it being before. It's really time for them to decide what to do about this and I think part of the reason why they're stressed is because they don't know exactly what to say to you. But I think they're going to figure something out. Let me ask when this is going to happen. If you haven't met your soulmate yet, when are you going to meet them? Let me clean up these cards. Please excuse me while I shuffle these cards. I will get a fortune for you. I'm going to shuffle these cards a little bit more since I threw in all the ones we were reading with. We got a couple jumpers and then one that I pulled. The one I pulled said, many will travel to hear you speak. This one says, a light heart carries you through all the hard times and ask a friend to join you on the next voyage. This is crazy. This is like your person coming and wanting to join you, join with you, and get through tough things together. This person could be at a distance from you. I have travel and voyage on two of these. They want to see you and spend time together in order to help help this person through the next journey in their life. Let me, okay, when are you gonna meet with this person? When are you gonna meet with this person? Okay, this is a starter. I feel like this is soon because the temperance is in reverse. The judgment is upright. This is how I want to answer the question. This is gonna come in a time where you feel like you're, you're making it. It could, you don't have to have made it but it's gonna come on a day where you feel like you're on top of the world and your person too it's gonna come to them in a time where they feel like they're tired of feeling caught up by the world around them and they want to express themselves on a more soul level without the world in between you two When this person makes a solid judgment and puts down some of their their pride and defensive walls, this person will come toward you. If you know this person, if it's like a friend of a friend, perhaps you'll be able to recognize when they start dropping their guard in order to find themselves a little bit more. If you don't, I feel like this is happening soon if you haven't met this person yet. 
we saw the judgment in reverse in their energy and what is going to happen so i feel like it's a couple steps to get there but when the judgment is in is in reverse if it's some if it's a struggle that we're dealing with in our life our next obstacle is to turn it upright so I feel like this is happening very soon. That is your reading. I normally do extendeds on YouTube that are free. I have been making a few candles that are cute. They're all animal themes. This one's a whale. I have another whale one. I just made this one this week. And I made a walrus this week too. You could tell that used to be a plant holder. But I'm saying a small prayer for you guys. I appreciate all of you being here and I'll see you next time.